It is one of the beauties of having the winter meetings here in Nashville. We get a Nashville resident <laughs> dropping by to talk to us. The Blue Jays catcher, J.P. Aaron Sebia, is here. And my, has the look of your team changed since uh, you finished up the season last year. What do you think of all the changes? Excited, excited. Looking uh, forward to when we can report the spring training. I've been counting it down and just working hard and getting as ready as I can to, uh, to help this team win. Two new starting pitchers are now in the mix, Josh Johnson and Mark Burley. As a starting catcher, have you reached out to those guys or do you know them from past experience? First day it was official, I reached out and, and I wanted to make sure everything went through and, and uh, reached out to them right away and said, you know, excited to work with them. I uh, called our video guy and, and said, hey, I want film on all these, you know, these guys and, and uh, to see that you know, when it comes time to, to work with these guys in spring training, I already know uh, from, from you know, a few hours of film and watching them how they like to attack hitters that I'll be ready to catch them. What has Alex Anthopoulos told you about your role this year? I mean, they acquired John Buck in the deal. For the first time in your career, you're having to deal with your name being floated out in trade rumors. What do you know about where you're going to be on opening day this year? The same thing that he told the media uh, when he addressed the media, um, you know, preceding the trade. He said, you know, you're our starting catcher. You're a guy who's, who's going to be our everyday guy, and John Buck knows that he's the backup, and, and uh, he's accepting of that role, and, and uh, you know, that's the way it's going to be. And, you know, I love to hear all, all these, uh, you know, rumors and, and uh, you know, people tweeting at me and everything that I have coming on. Uh, you know, it's, a, it's an honor, obviously, if you're a guy who's a guy who, you know, is in trade rumors is, is because, you know, you're a good player and, and different people want you. But I'm happy to be a Blue Jay and I'm going to stay a Blue Jay, so I'm not too worried about him. You're not losing any sleep over the possibility that you could be traded. No, no, I, I think uh, people are buying into that way too much, but I know where I'm going to be, so I'm okay. John Buck has done a nice job of selling the new Blue Jays, the guys at least coming from the Miami Marlins, on the city and the country. I know you love your travels throughout Canada and have spent some time there uh, this off season. What would you tell the new guys? Uh, just that it's, you know, one, you're not playing for a city, you're playing for an entire country, which is the, the greatest honor, I think, that anyone can talk about in the major leagues is, is no one has that opportunity. So we're, we're lucky uh, to be able to do that. And, and second, you know, we're, we're in, a, in a market that people want us to win. You know, people are, are around the team. People have been, been excited for winning a uh, team in, in Canada. And on the Argos just won, so congratulations to them, obviously. <laughs> but, but uh, you know, I think, I think there's a lot of, there's a lot of uh, excitement behind the team. And I think these guys understand that they're not just coming to a team that's maybe here to compete. You know, this is a contending team. This is a team that, that can do a lot of damage. There's more pressure on you guys now. Are you okay with that? I, I welcome it. I, I've from day one. I've always said that you know I would know when they ask about being in a different division. Uh, I don't want to be in a different division. I don't want to shy away from playing the Yankees, 18, 20, 30 times a year. You know the Red Sox, whoever it is uh, in that division. I want to play the best, and and you want to be the best. So that's that's the way it stands for me. Well, I know I speak for baseball fans across Canada, but uh, can't wait for opening day. Thanks for joining us. Uh, thanks for having me, and welcome to my city. Yeah, that is J.P. Arancibia, resident of Nashville and catcher for the Toronto Blue Jays.